Good morning. Welcome. Thank you so much for joining in this practice today. Our practice today will be about a 45 minute chair practice. As you can see, we will, we will do some standing up uh, movements here, but feel free and know that all of what we're going to do today can be done from right in your chair. So feel free to grab any gear that you may need. I didn't grab anything. I'm just gonna use my chair today. But if you'd like to grab maybe a strap or uh, any blocks or pillows, if you find that when you're seated, maybe your knees are either above your hips or too low below your, nip, uh, below your hips, you can sit on a pillow or you can put some pillows underneath your feet to offer a little bit of leverage there. Completely up to you. So from wherever you happen to be seated, welcome. I'm so glad you're here with us today. I invite you to allow your gaze to soften as you begin to settle into your space. As your gaze begins to soften, use the next breath or two and just notice how you arrive into this space and if you need to shift or adjust at all. So use that moment of internal awareness and just give yourself permission to settle in. As you settle in and your gaze begins to soften, allow your focus to soften. So in yoga, we call this our drishti. Allow your drishti, your focal point, to begin to soften around the entrance. As your focal point begins to soften, with the next couple of breaths, begin to check in with your body from head to toe. And just begin to notice how you arrive into this physical space. Just another breath or so, checking in with your body, noticing just how it arrives into this moment. From your physical body, gradually draw your attention into your breath body. Begin to notice what you notice. Notice the quality of your inhales and exhales. Notice the gentle rhythm of your breath. Without trying to change anything, without striving for anything in particular, just observe and notice. I invite you to place one hand on your belly and one hand on your heart. And begin to check in with the gentle rhythm of each breath. Observe the gentle expansion of your belly and ribs as you inhale and the gentle release as you exhale.
And gradually allow your breath to deepen into the bowl of your belly. Allow your breath to expand front to back and side to side. With the next couple of breaths, allow each inhale to radiate and expand fully into your entire body. And allow each exhale to soften. Almost imagine your breath as a warm and healing light. And each inhale expands this light into your body working its way into any areas that may need a little extra attention, a little extra love and support. And with each exhale, imagine that light taking with it anything that does not serve you in this time and space. Allow your breath to become dynamic. Begin to notice this connection between your breath and your body. Or maybe it's just an idea of a connection between your breath and your body. And I invite for you to allow your awareness to regularly be drawn to this connection between breath and body as we move through our practice. Float both hands up to your heart. And from this space around your hands and hearts, come into a place or an idea that feels a little something like gratitude. And from this place or idea of gratitude, bring to mind one thing that you are grateful for today. And hold this gratitude in your heart as we move through your practice. Release your hands, bring them to your lap. Allow your inhale to lengthen through your spine as you exhale. Gently lower your right ear to your right shoulder. Lower your chin to your chest. Bring your left ear to your left shoulder as you inhale. Big full breath in. Exhale, lower your chin to your chest. And bring your right ear to your right shoulder. And inhale back to center. Nice big length into your spine as you exhale. Look over your right shoulder. Breathe fully. As you inhale, lift your gaze to the sky. And then exhale, bring your left, uh, your chin to your left shoulder. Big full breath. And one more time, inhale, let your gaze and chin go to the sky. Exhale, right shoulder to chin. And then back to center. Inhale, lift your shoulders to your ears, roll them forward. We'll do that a few times. Working from the crown of our head down to our toes today. And then reverse, inhale, shoulders to your ears, and then let them slide down your back, offering a bit of a gentle heart or chest opener here. You reach your fingertip down towards the earth, inhale, sweep your arms out to shoulder height, lengthen and open your palms up to the sky. Big full breath in. Exhale, roll your palms down, lower your chin to your chest. Inhale, lift your gaze, lift your heart, open your palms. Exhale, lower your chin, lower your chest, lower your gaze. One more time. Inhale, open. Exhale, release. And inhale, lengthen through your fingertips, find center, 
And then cross your right arm on top, the left arm underneath. Give yourself a hug or pat on the back. Allow your breath to be full and expansive. And reverse inhale. Open your arms nice and long. And bring your left arm on top, right arm underneath. Give yourself a second hug or pat on the back. Allow your breath to be full. Inhale, open your arms out nice and wide. Bend with your elbows and as you exhale, draw your arms together. Inhale, open up. Exhale, together. One more time. Inhale, open your arms nice and wide. As you exhale, bring your hands to your knees. Then you slide a little bit forward on your chair <clears throat> so that you're still supported. As you inhale, lift your heart, lift your gaze, gentle cow stretch. Exhale, round your spine, chin to your chest for cat stretch. And just move with your breath in. Now soften your belly forward, heart and gaze lift. Exhale, round. And a couple more just like that. One more time. Inhale, find center. Let your hands touch down by your side. And now sweep your right arm up, hold your chair with your left hand, pin down over to the left. And now sweep your arms up, right hand to the chair, left arm up and over. Gentle hinge to the right. One more time on each side. Inhale, reach both arms up to the sky. And as you exhale, reach through your fingertips like someone's holding your hand. Reach, reach, reach. And then gently hinge forward, finding a seated child's pose. Seated balasana, this place of balance. Allow your breath to be full into your entire back side of your body. Bring your hands to your hips or your knees. Inhale, lengthen through your spine. Find center. One more time, bring your hands to your knees. And just make some circles into our spine. So inhale, lengthen through your spine. As you exhale, hinge on over to the right. Round it forward. Inhale, up the left side, back to center. Once more in this direction. Hinge on over, lean, round it forward, let everything soften. Up the left side, back to center, big full breath here, and as you exhale, reverse, lean on over to the left. Round it forward, up the right side, back to center. And one more time. Big full breath. Extend your right leg out nice and long. So we'll work through this in stages. Feel free to pause in that place that works best for you. So reach your right leg out nice and long. Option two, <clears throat> cross your left ankle over your right. Option two, slide your ankle up your leg a little bit right about where your calf may be or your shin. And the other option would be to bring your right foot to the floor and allow your left ankle to rest on your knee. Just be mindful of your left knee here. Make sure that you flex your foot and create a little bit of traction in your leg here to provide a bit of support for your knee. 
Wherever you happen to be, whether it's on your knee or down by your ankle, I invite you to draw in a nice big full inhale. And as you exhale, draw your heart towards your toes, gently leaning forward. Inhale, press into your feet, come back to center. One more time, hinge forward. And we'll pause here, big full breath. And come back to center. Uncross your legs, bring them both down to the earth. Big full breath in. Exhale, release. And we'll play that on side B. So reach your left leg out nice and long. Option two, cross your right ankle. Maybe your right ankle comes up just below your knee at your shin or maybe your ankle comes just above your knee with your left foot on the earth. It's up to you wherever you are, breathe fully. Find that most accessible space. Big full inhale and as you exhale, hinge forward. Root through your feet, inhale, come back to center. And exhale, hinge forward. Big full breath here. Press into your feet, come back to center. Bring both feet to the mat. Inhale. And exhale. So step your feet nice and wide. <clears throat> if your chair is on your mat, your feet will probably be just beyond hips width. Allow your ankles to be at least under your knees. Bring your hands to your knees, big full inhale, lengthen through your spine. And as you exhale, drop your right shoulder to the center. Inhale, lengthen. And drop your left shoulder. One more time on each side, inhale, lengthen. Drop your right shoulder. Inhale, lengthen. Drop your left shoulder. Inhale, lengthen. And exhale, release. Bring your feet back to about hips width and on your inhale, stand. Bring your self <laughs> to just behind your chair. So face your chair so that your <clears throat> facing the back of your chair so you can hold on if you'd like. And just lift and lower your feet. So I, I should be more specific. As you inhale, lift your heels. And as you exhale, lift your toes off the mat. Maybe lift the balls of your feet off the mat. Spread your toes out nice and wide. Inhale, lift your heels. And exhale, release. One more time on each side. And just allow your feet to check in under your hips. Allow your hands to reach down below your shoulders towards the earth. Big full breath. Check in and notice what you notice. On your inhale, sweep your arms up to the sky. And as you exhale, step your left foot back. Allow your right knee to bend, and as it does, make sure that your knee lines up just over your ankle. Allow your breath to be full here. Allow your shoulders to soften. Root through your feet, inhale, sweep your arms up. Maybe open your heart up to the sky, big full breath in. And exhale, release, come back to center, step your feet together, mindfully, carefully. Big full breath in. And out. Nice big full inhale, shift your weight over to your left foot. 
and step your right foot back. Make sure that your knee is over your ankle, allow your breath to be full. Press evenly into both feet. Now on your inhale, option, leave your hands on your chair, maybe they reach up to the sky. One more big full breath. Exhale, release. Bring your feet together. Step both feet back so that you're a couple feet away from your chair. <clears throat> Inhale, sweep your arms up to the sky. And as you exhale, bend your knees, reach your hands to your chair, find a gentle forward fold. Allow your breath to create buoyancy in your torso. So allow your breath to fill the entire backside of your body. Exhale, soften. Bend your knees, inhale. Reach your arms all the way up to the sky. Exhale, hands to your Step your feet out nice and wide so that you are facing uh, the side of your mat, the long edge of your mat. And allow your chair to be on the right side of your body so that your right hip is in line with your chair. <clears throat> Turn your right toes out and then just rock your hips from side to side. And allow your left hip to line up with your left knee and your foot. So they're all facing the same direction. Press into your right foot. Inhale, reach your arms to shoulder height. And as you exhale, reach through your right fingertips, create a nice long right side. Lower your hands to the chair, left hand to your hip, and pause here for a breath. Create that length and that space through your entire left side. Option to leave your hand on your hip or maybe it reaches up and over. Breathe fully. Root through your feet. Inhale, come back to center and then bend your right knee. And just as you need to here so that your right ankle is just underneath your knee, allow your breath to be full. Press into your feet, inhale back to center. Lower your hands, turn your feet to face the same direction. Big full breath. Notice the differences between the two sides as you exhale. And then we'll play that on side B. So switch your either body or your chair so that your left hip is aligned with your chair, the back of your chair. <clears throat> Turn your left toes out and then rock your hips from side to side. And pause. This time allow your right hip to line up with your knee and your ankle. Press into your left foot. Inhale, reach your arms to shoulder height. Exhale, reach through your fingertips, nice long left side. Bring your right hand to the chair, left hand to the chair, right hand to your hip. Pause and breathe. Lengthen through your entire right side. Option, leave your hand on your hip, or maybe it reaches up and over. One more big full breath here. Root through your feet, inhale, back to center, bend into your left knee. Arms to shoulder height, lengthen through your fingertips. Breathe fully. Inhale, back to center. Turn your feet so that they face the same direction. Hands either to your hips or maybe they clasp behind you. Wrap your upper arms back, folding your entire front body. And as you exhale, hinge forward. 
Option to use your chair <clears throat> or bring your hand to the earth. With the next couple of breaths, I invite you to move in any stretch or direction that feels best in your body. Whatever you need in this time and space. Just another breath or two. And ever so mindfully and gently make your way back to center, press into your feet, hands to your hips, lengthen your spine. Full breath. Take a moment, find your mountain pose, your Tadasana. <clears throat> Allow your feet to check in under your hips. Root through your feet, lengthen your spine. Begin to find a gentle connection through your center body, creating a bit of an easeful approach into your lower back. Option to hold the chair with your hand. So I'm going to shift my weight into my left foot. It all depends on what side you happen to be closest to the chair here. Bring your right foot or your opposite foot down to touch the earth. Breathe fully, find the length in your spine. Hold that length, hold that strength in your center body. Breathe fully. Option to leave your right toes on the earth maybe they come in at your ankle or your calf maybe your right foot touches into your inner thigh wherever it's going to be today is absolutely perfect allow your breath to be full option to bring your hands to your heart breathe one more option to reach your hands up to the sky. Nice big full inhale. And exhale, release. Bring everything back to center. Big full breath and just notice the differences between the two sides. And then we'll shift to side B. So either shift your body or if you're using your chair, maybe bring your chair to the other side. So my chair happens to be on my right side here. Root into your right foot. Let your left foot touch down onto the earth. And as you find the space, pause. Find that connection into your center body. Find that length in your spine. It's easy to want to sit in our hip here. But keep lengthening so that your effort is equal on both sides. Option to leave your toes on the earth, your left toes, maybe they touch in at your ankle or your calf. Or maybe they come up to your inner thigh. Wherever you're going to be today is absolutely perfect. When you're ready, pause, find that space of balance. Maybe it's an exploration of balance. And that's okay too. Maybe your hands come to your heart. Breathe fully. On your inhale, sweep your arms up to the sky. Big full breath. Lengthen. And exhale, release. Pause and notice what you notice. And with the next couple of breaths, gently make your way onto your chair. And 
We will <clears throat> sit in our chair. So I'm going to turn to the side here because that's a little bit more comfortable for me. But feel free to stay square on your chair if you'd like. So I'm going to sit so that my right hip is on the chair and my left leg is free, if you will. I'm going to slide my left leg back. So there's obviously options here. We are aiming for the front part of our body, feeling a little bit of a stretch here. If that is uncomfortable for you, feel free to leave your knee just underneath your hip. The further back you go with your foot, the deeper the stretch will be. If you feel any pinching in your low back, bring your foot in a little bit. Always shift and adjust so that this is most comfortable in your body. My right hand is on the chair for a bit of support. Breathe fully in this space. On your inhale, option to reach your left arm up to the sky. Deep full breath in. Exhale, release. Bring everything back to center. And we'll shift to the other side. So I did a lot of talking to get us set up on the other side, but we'll stay in this space for just as long on this side, maybe. So one side's going to cooperate better than the other, and it's okay. Honor that, recognize that, check in with that. Allow your breath to be full. If you find that your low back tends, if you find that you tend to sink in your low back here, Find that lengthening through your spine and draw your ribs and your pelvis together. Create that strength in the front part of your body so that the back part of your body can be a bit more easeful. On your inhale, sweep the right arm up to the sky. Big full breath in. Exhale, release. Bring everything back to center. Breathe fully. And then we'll turn to face you one more time. Hands by your side. On your inhale, sweep your arms up to the sky. And as you exhale, gently hinge forward. Breathe fully. Maybe hug your knees in here. Rock your head from side to side. On your inhale, lengthen through your spine. Come back to center. Reach your arms up to the sky. And exhale, twist to the right. So as you twist to the right, pause. So use your hands to lengthen through your fingertips. Create a nice long extension. Bring your left hand to your knee and right hand to your hip or the chair so that your upper body is making the twist happen and your hands aren't cranking you into oblivion. You're letting your body do the work here, your torso specifically. Allow your breath to be full. And on your inhale, sweep your arms up to the sky. Exhale, twist open to the left. So again, pause and reach, lengthen through your fingertips, create space. I'll turn to the side so you can see what I'm doing. Reach, 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 lengthen, lengthen, and then let your right hand touch down to your left knee, and your left hand comes to your head. So that your torso and your spine makes the twist happen. Breathe fully here. And 
and inhale, reach your arms up to the sky. Exhale, release, bring your hands behind you, bend your elbows, curl your shoulder blades together, lift your heart up to the sky. Breathe fully. Inhale, back to center. And use the next couple of breaths to bring the movement, stretch, or direction that feels best in your body. Maybe it's a movement we did or a stretch we did. Maybe it's something we didn't do. And that's okay. It's whatever your body needs in this space. Give yourself permission to breathe and to move in your more, most organic way. And you feel as though your practice is complete as it's going to be. Settle into your relaxation space. So allow your body to be fully supported. You can stay in the chair here if you'd like. If lying down flat on your back in a reclined position is what your body needs right now, go for it. You can always use uh, your chair as support. So if you're lying down, you can bring your calf muscles onto the seat of the chair. Sometimes that elevation can be nice. It's whatever your body needs. I will stay seated in my chair or feel free to find your most comfortable space, whatever that looks like. Allow your gaze to soften. Draw in a nice big full inhale. Exhale, sigh it away. One more big full breath. The next few breaths here, just give yourself permission to settle in. It's easy to finish our practice, rest for a moment or so, and then turn everything off and be done. But give yourself this time, these few minutes of time to breathe, to allow your body and practice to integrate. Each time you notice your attention begin to wander or drift, I'll do so patiently and kindly Bring your attention and awareness back to the rhythm and the sensations of your own breath within your own physical body. Give yourself full and complete permission to be supported by the mat underneath you. And to be supported by the breath within you. Allow yourself to be present with what may arise.
Just a few more moments here. Allow yourself to breathe in this space without judgment, without a story. Just allow yourself to breathe. The next couple of breaths, allow each inhale and exhale to deepen. Bring movement to your fingers and toes. <clears throat> Rock your head from side to side. And from wherever you happen to be on your inhale, reach your arms overhead, maybe lengthen from fingertips to toes. And exhale, gently release if you're lying down to hug your knees into your chest. And even if you're seated, you can hug your knees in. Pause, hold gratitude in your heart for your body as perfect as it is. And for this time that you have given yourself today. And gently make your way to a most comfortable seated position, whatever that looks like for you. And one more time, bring one hand to your belly. One hand to your heart. <clears throat> Check in with the rhythm of your breath. Check in with the sensations within your own body. Notice what you notice. And gently float both hands up to your heart. And from this space around your hands and heart, come to that place or an idea. Maybe it's a sensation of gratitude. And from that place or idea or sensation of gratitude, bring to mind one more thing that you are grateful for today. And release your hands. Inhale, sweep your palms up to the sky, let them touch together. Honor yourself, those around you, and your yoga practice. Exhale, hands to your forehead, that your thoughts may bring peace to yourselves and those around you to your lips, that your words may bring peace to yourselves and those around you, and to your hearts, that your actions may bring peace to yourselves and those around you. Thank you so much for joining in this practice today. I hope you have a really beautiful rest of your day. The light in me sees and honors the light in each and every one of you.